Alright guys, welcome to part one of making a Minecraft hacked client. I haven't done this in over two years, but I decided to maybe start doing it again, so... Yeah, let's get right to it. Um, first thing you're going to want to do is get MCP to decompile Minecraft. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description for this. Um, just click that, and it should start downloading for you right here. And it should take a little bit like a couple seconds so wait for that to finish downloading and make a folder on your desktop and you can name this anything I'm just gonna name it tutorial client and next drag this download into there drag MCP into that folder you just made or you can just go to downloads from here uh, just click that folder icon and navigate to it. Um, open the tutorial client. Oops, sorry, it opened on my other monitor. And right click and hit extract here. So then you should get a bunch of batch files and folders and you're going to want to look for a certain batch file called decompile.bat. Oh, you can close this out too. So, whoops, mouse is going crazy. Um, Double click this decompile.bat and you should get a command prompt um, window coming up. And it's going to do this for a little bit, so I'm going to pause the video or fast forward it till when it finishes. Alright, guys, so when this finishes, it should prompt you to press any key to continue, so I'll just hit space, doesn't really matter. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, the IDE we're going to use in this program is called Eclipse. Make sure you have that installed. You can just Google Eclipse. And, um, you're also going to want the Java Developers Kit. Just search JDK and download that as well. I'll leave links in the description. But, um, if we open up Eclipse... Oh, it's on my other window again. You're going to want to go hit Browse and... Look for the folder you made on the desktop, so I'm going to look for a tutorial client. And then go to Eclipse, and make sure you're hovered or highlighted on Eclipse. So hit OK, OK again, and it should bring up the source code of Minecraft, if it worked. And yeah, here it is, it worked. Okay, so now we have some errors we need to fix. One is, in, if you hover over here, it says right here, the errors. Um, we don't need to worry about the server, we can just ignore that, in realms. So we need to go to jars, libraries, com, mojang, realms, <laughs> this right here, open that. Now for this jar, just right click it, build path, and then add to build path. Okay, now lastly what you want to do is go here, right click, build path, configure build path. Go to libraries tab and go to the you'll see a jar that says realms and has an X on it. Make sure you delete that one. Hover over it, remove. Once you do that, you should be able to run Minecraft. The console will let you know. So that's pretty much it how to set up Minecraft and I'll see you guys in the next one.